and welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills. Guys, I have some tea for you from here, from beautiful Beverly Hills, which is not so beautiful sometimes. But before we get into it, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys. Do it right now. It really helps me a lot. We are on the race to 15K, so if you are new here and you want to join the Beverly Troop, the only thing that you need to do is subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit my notification bell. Well, hit that notification bell right here. And let's talk about this mess because Brandy Glanville, you know, thirsty AF as always, she needed to do something to put her name on the tabloids. She was like, girl, I haven't read my name in a while. Let's see what she, bullshit I can do, right? <sighs> okay, so do you, you guys know everything that is happening with Army Hammer, right? Cannibalism. Uh, abuse, alleged abuse, this and that, and text and kinky shit, and all that. Nothing has been verified, you know. This is, I mean, they all, not, no one knows anything. The only thing that we know about Army Hammer is that he is kinky AF, he is into some very weird shit out there, right? And then, I think that was like two days ago, he was dropped by everyone like publicist PR, like movies, like, I don't know, everything, you know, like even the, I don't know, the post was like, mm -mm, I'm not delivering that shit to that house anymore, you know? So he was dropped by everyone. Well, there are some rumors out there, and this is only rumors, guys, this part, it's only rumors, that Army Hammer was working on, on a hotel during uh, summer of, I think it was last year, or last, last year, I think it was last year. And he was working in a, in a hotel of a friend who is also very like famous or rich or something, you know, uh, in Palm Springs. And then around Palm Springs, the remains of apparently two or three people have been found. And the rumors were that the reason why everyone decided to drop Army Hammer was because allegedly he was going to be involved in that murder investigation. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so we are caught, right? Now, these are only rumors. Nothing hasn't come out. There are a lot, guys, a lot of people discrediting all the information out there on the internet. So at this point, we actually don't know what is true and what is fake, right? Well, Brandy Glanville, being Brandy, decided to go, you know, to Twitter and say, Army Hammer, that, I mean, look, she said, Army Hammer can have my rib cage. How do you keep getting hotter and hotter? Let's have a barbecue. Guys, can you believe that I was, I did the whole video about Brandy and another video and I realized after I finished that my phone died. Girl, I was like, I'm not gonna do all that shit again, so I'm just gonna keep telling you what we're talking about because anyways, it's the same information, so I don't need to, you know, dress up for that, right? So, um, basically, yeah, so uh, Brandy posted that tweet about Army Hammer, please eat me, and... <laughs> <laughs> I something. I mean, you already you already know what she said. I, I you literally just watch it, <laughs> and everyone was like, "Girl, what is wrong with you? Like, uh, look, everything that is happening. You know, Army Hammer is is he's not only only like uh, into the kinky shit of cannibalism and all that, but now he's also." being framed for possibly murder allegedly and all the things so everyone was like what is wrong with you ton deaf like you know everything and then of course he ended up uh, erasing deleting the the tweet and then she posts guys guys I didn't know about the extent of what's being alleged I just read he was getting a divorce and I thought that he was hot no more headline porn for me. I learned my lesson. Girl, we know that, I mean, she, first of all, she 
posts about tea all the time on her Instagram. And she talks about tea on her podcast. So you know that she has the connections and the knowledge to know what is happening over there. And unless you have been living under a rock, there is no way that you didn't know everything that is happening with Army Hammer right now. Second of all, like, you literally offer him your rib cage. Okay? So, <laughs> like, you know what is happening. Stop being so thirsty for attention, Brandy, honestly. Because, remember, I mean, you're gonna, you are digging your own grave. Remember when, when Andy said something like, oh, um, uh, he said to Brandy, you are not on that island anymore. Like, you are closer home. Like, basically insinuating that maybe she will be back at some point. She's gone. She's out of that island. She's in Japan. She's at the other side of the world. Like, there is no coming back, you know? So, stop playing with us. Just tell us that you were thirsty for attention and you wanted, you know, your name out there. And, or, I don't know, maybe you want to be... uh Army's uh, submissive. I don't know. What is the name of that? Submissive. No, submissive. Yeah, but like dominatrix is like the Dominate. top. So who? She's she's a sub. There's a dom and a sub. Well, whatever. She wants to be to like into S and M and all that shit. Anyways. No, she said let's go to a barbecue. <laughs> let's barbecue Let, yeah it was like hashtag let's have a barbecue anyways guys so there you have it sorry for you know the change of scenery but I was already too tired to do all the things again and let me know what you guys think in the comments below do you think that Brandy was actually thirsty for attention or do you think that she was actually just an airhead and didn't know what was happening let me know, guys, and don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys, and I'll see you around. See ya!